Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 471. Now this is a hard level, so I'm going to boost her up right away. Let's bring in a coconut wheel. This would give me a color bomb right at the very beginning. This would give me both a striped and wrapped candy right at the very beginning. A coconut wheel, notice it says add coconut wheels to the candy mix. So while we're playing, we might get more than one coconut wheel. And I'll show you why I'm bringing in a special. Yes, this is solvable without a special. However, it's tough, and we might have to play it through 50 times in order to get the right configuration. Even using our skills, it may take that long to have a, a lucky board that helps us. So what we do is we bring in some manufactured luck. Now, we need in 25 moves to bring down four ingredients. They're all going to come from here, and they're going to come speedily. We don't have to take out one ingredient before another one shows up. We can deposit them in any one of these receptacles down here, these green arrows. The thing that's blocking us, besides the thick frosting, is that in 15 moves, these are going to explode if we don't eradicate them. That's why I brought the coconut wheel. It's going to help us make those horizontally striped candies that are so important to this board for success. Now I have the choice of making a striped or a wrapped candy. Striped candies are the order of the day when they're off along the sides here. That's what's going to help us open both sides up. Wrapped candies are good for when they're along here or really close in to the action so that we can, um, you know, take out the ticking time bombs in two hits. I, I should say, you know, the the, stri the wrapped candy will hit twice. This will go across the board, so that's why I chose this. Now I also need to um, detonate it, and I've decided to bring it down because these are almost open, so I want to detonate it closer to this area because these are harder to reach. Oh, look at that. Well, I have to do this, don't I? I don't care where these are sitting at the time. I'm going to go ahead and do this and take out those ticking time bombs. We always have to play the board. No matter what plan we set up, if the board shows us something better or different, uh, we need to consider it. All right. So we're close now. We just have to bring these all the way down. We're going to keep working on this frosting, just hack away at it. Let's see, 12 more moves. I want to use them judiciously. Looking for opportunities for some aerial strikes. Uh, actually, I just want to get this. Oh, I don't want to do that. I want to get this detonated on the level it is. I do, do not want to bring it up a level. All right, we're taking all of this out. Here we go. We're setting up so we have a special that can really just take... We're, we're trying to set this up with a striped candy. And the blues want to cooperate with us. Here we go. So two ingredients down and two more down. That's how we beat level 471. I was on probably my eighth life without boosters. I bring in one booster and I get it on the first try. So consider using boosters or keep playing it. Now you know the strategy. You have to take out the color bombs, the, I'm sorry, the ticking time bombs with something. Um, and you can keep playing it without boosters and see if you can do it. But my advice, Go the easy route, get to the next level. Once you have gone to the top and you're looking um, for something to do because you're waiting on levels, that's when you can come back and play without boosters and get triple stars and everything. If you want to see more videos, you can always subscribe. And thanks so much for watching.